2800 for the top. No, don't do it. Okay, no, I'm not doing it. Save for evil. Psycho if it comes back or. Thingy. Uh, for, for now, if it actually happens. Mm -hmm. Or. Or. Agent Jonesy if he ends up being in the item shop. Although he's going to be cheap if his rarity remains as a um, uncommon. Although I feel like they might change it. I feel like the uncommon's probably just a placeholder. Holy just god. For, just for the memes and then I now would then have four icon series of Earths that are all um actually no technically I'd have five because I have keep it mellow, but no one uses that. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even think I use it on my fucking marshmallow though. Okay, but what would I re oh, I would have to replace I'd have to replace I don't want to replace Tiniest Violin because I gotta use that if I ever get a win. <laughs> yep. Uh, for, at least for this loadout, I can't replace Fresh because, uh, well, it's never coming back. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, and then I can't replace any of the other Icon series because that would then just ruin the whole point of having the Icon series emotes altogether. So it would literally, I'd have to get rid of Pirouette. Do I buy it? Oh, I'm debating. I could flip a coin. Yes, coin flips. I love them. Oh, ten cents. <laughs> ten cent. Ten okay. cent. Yep. Yeah, cool. Okay, which side heads that side? Okay, which one's it gonna be then? Wh which which one for? Or I buy the emote. Uh, heads yes, tails no. Okay. It's heads. Well, there you which go is... then. There we go, I bought it. <laughs> Claim. I am the guy. Now I don't have enough for the ball bus. <laughs> <laughs> but don't worry, I'll be getting more. Oh, <laughs> yeah. I think I have like 200. How, how much? Yeah, 200 more in Battle Pass itself. Mm -hmm. uh, then 100. So yeah, so I'm on, so I'm on 645. So uh, 745, 845, and then the 150 I get tomorrow would be 955. So, yeah. That reminds me, I need to, I need to get another ten thousand before next month. <laughs> Why? For the next battle pass. Why ten thousand? Two hundred. 
Oh. So what, do you just get the 13th? Uh... Yeah. The... Yeah. The... 13,500. <laughs> yeah, normally I do. 60, 60 fucking four quid. <laughs> yeah. It used to be 80, dude. Did it? Yeah. Oh, was that before the whole apple? Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, I forgot what the old prices were. It used um, to be a rip-off. Although I'm pretty sure I've spent less money on Fortnite than a certain other game. Uh, because I uh, went through my transaction history on PlayStation. Looked for all the games, and I think the money I've spent the most on is Overwatch. Oh god, that game's cursed as fuck. And <laughs> I think uh, I spent somewhere within the region of 200 and 300 pounds. Oh god. Yeah, around 200 to 300 pounds spent on loot boxes. <laughs> of course. <laughs> because that was the, that was all there was back back then. Yeah. That, that's all. The, that's all the games had. Every, every game that had, you know, the, there was no battle passes. True. There was not nothing like that. All the games that had microtransactions had loot boxes. Call of Duty had them. Um, one second, quick, look from the game library. Scroll down, scroll down. Yeah, so Call of Duty had them. De Destiny, kind of. No, 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 they didn't really have loot boxes. They did have microtransactions, though. That were kind of stupid. Um, Star Wars Battlefront 2 being an example of, you know, when they started, when people started to actually be like, yo, this shit's insane, why are you doing this? And then I had the infamous Reddit post, which I have no idea if it's still the most downward post history or not. Um, but yeah, there's the m multiple Call of Duty's had. It goes like since, I think since Call of Duty Black Ops 3 all the way to, uh, not the previous one, but the one before, I can't remember what one it was before, or what was, oh, Black Ops 4, that was it. Um, yeah, like I said, Overwatch app, um, uh, try and look here. Thanks, Barkling and Jay.
Fuck him, because I'm getting the fucking prime examples. Fucking CSGO Team Fortress 2. They've got their own fucking versions. Although they, you know, have a whole market. Try this, you've just rejected. Uh, what? So, I, I guess that's a bit different, but still. They have their own versions. You just did this the other day, didn't you? I'm not going insane. Let me get my fucking thing off. Uh, yeah, you did. Oh yeah, rock em. Yesterday. It says. Slum. Um. Well, thank you for the nine months. Appreciate it. What the fuck? That's like we think of because most games changed their system. And now most games you see either have like either a battle pass system or they'll have like an item shop where you can just, you know, straight up buy stuff where it's like on a rotation. So it's, it's, I want to say it's better that way. But yeah, the worst offenders were Call of Duty and Overwatch, I would say. Yeah. But I, still, I, I just still can't believe I spent that much. I can't believe that, to be fair. Uh, Actually, that's not even that bad. Uh, I may or may not have spent like a grand on Fortnite. Yeah, I mean, yeah, but that's you. You've got to be in job. <laughs> You've got a job. <laughs> it's still terrible. Yeah, I know, but you've got a job and you're not living on your own. If you were living on your own, then yeah, you could see because you know you got you got to pay your own fucking bills and everything. You know, I'd be that person that goes, no, V Bucks comes first. <laughs> well, v, v Bucks becomes comes before a hot meal. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Let's see if it. I, I know, okay, so I think there was literally only one or two purchases where it wasn't actually on the boxes because I know they had like one or two like skins you could straight up but buy and I think like the money went to uh, charity or something it did that once or twice so I know one or two of the purchases but that was only like I think £11 Oh right, okay, yeah Possibly less. And then there's just a time when I put it. And that's the thing, I looked and at some point they must have reduced the price of the loot boxes. At some point. I don't know when. But they obviously did it at some point. Which then just made it so my rate of buying them went up. It's like an addiction. Like, I was spending roughly the same amount of money, but the frequency between buying them was... ...crazy. I mean, technically, I guess it was. And now look at it. I don't play the game anymore, I don't even own the game. <laughs> <laughs> no, so, you know, it's dead. <laughs> no PC. It's the, the game's pretty much still like PC for console. On console, I, I, I have no idea. Probably dead. But it's weird because with that game, PC was actually like the the main version that everyone played anyway. Yeah. 
True. Because we yeah, well, most games like with games like Call of Duty and all that, the PCs normally like the, the like with first person shooters. Normally, the PC version's the least played version. All right. Interesting. Of course, now 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 it's different because more people are uh, mm. are investing in gaming PCs and stuff, especially with the price of. You, the new generation of consoles. Oh, I found the exact amount. Oh it, god. It was in my... Because I, I used my phone's calculator to add it all up <laughs> as I was scrolling through each amount. And I just remembered to buy phone's calculator. It has a history button. <laughs> and I can, I can literally see this calculation that's like... 179 plus... 179 plus 449 plus... 849 plus 679. <laughs> of, of a random price, so it was three hundred and nine pounds and sixty seven pence. Jesus, and that was uh, let's see, when did I stop playing? That? Let's see, it came out in 2016. I don't think I got it until like it came, okay, it came out in May 2016. I don't think I got it until like late 2016. Mm -hmm. And I stopped playing it around 2018, possibly. Yeah, I think 2018 was around about when I stopped playing it. Mm -hmm. Uh, sometime after the two-year anniversary-ish roundabout, maybe? So, so that's like two years. Spent £309 on a game in two years. So that's from the start, so I need to go all the way back as well down this little scroll. Might be in another 
game that I have spent more money on, but it's technically... I technically wouldn't count it because it actually spans between multiple games, and that's uh, Call of Duty points. Ah, uh, okay. Because Call of Duty points actually like carry over from one game to another. So it would be pretty much impossible to determine which purchase was from which game. Although it would actually be interesting to see how much money I spent on a GTA <laughs> shark cards. So, six of seven. No, that was only like around two months after release. I love how in my transaction history there's literally a purchase uh, that cost zero pounds and zero pence, and the description is literally two. Mm -hmm. Just the number two. <laughs> The description is supposed to be what it is you're buying, uh, and it's, it's just two. <laughs> I bought the number two. <laughs> you bought two, yep. What made you think, yes, this is worth my money? I mean, it was free. They <laughs> <laughs> were just giving it away, so I thought, why the hell not? <laughs> why the hell not? Let's just get a number two, yeah, just for the fun of it. what the actual rates of getting the boxes in game were. I can't even remember if you could. I'm guessing you could. But I, I, I don't remember what the rates were. They're probably shit though, judging by how many fucking loot boxes you bought. Okay, let's go try and find the last purchase. Ordering pizza, what topping should I get? Ooh. Uh, getting all meat. Well, that's if you like meat. <laughs> yeah. Meat feast. Speaking of pizza and take, uh, take there is a new place opening up. I think next week. Oh, nice! It's a uh, tandoori place. Ooh! Very nice. So I'll probably have to go try it at some point. We just got the menu the other day. Um, seems pretty good. What they've got. In before it's uh, Hell's Kitchen. It's fucking raw! But I mean, the, the, it, used to, uh, it used to be a cafe where it is, and the cafe was pretty shit from what, I'm, from what I've been told from people who went there. We're in 2018, I'm still not seeing just this one boxes here. Although 
though, I am seeing purchases for V-Bucks. Yes! I got a thousand V-Bucks here, 2,800 there. <laughs> Another thousand there. Another thousand there. That's 800 there, Jesus, oh my god, what the fuck was I buying? <laughs> what the fuck previous me? This was 2018, this was. The peak of Fortnite. Let's see, what season was this? Maybe season 3? Uh... Twelfth of the six twenty. Oh, that'd have been season four going to season five. Okay. Actually, you know what? What? I might actually be able to find out if I spent it on, like what I spent it on, because if I know the date, I can go see what the item shop was that day. True. And then if I see a skin I have, I know that I bought that skin on that deal. Let's just do that so I can edit it. So... 2018... It was the 12th. Fuck it, dude! <sighs> uh, 12th of June. I don't think I bought anything that day. <laughs> do I... wait, do I own Burnout? If I own Burnout, I might have bought Burnout, but... If I did, then... fuck's sake, what was I... Let's try, let's try a different day. Uh, 26th of June. No, sorry, 22nd of June. And 26th was right. Above. And that was for a thousand. Bought a thousand. Wow. Uh, I did not buy anything from any of that. Oh no wait, I might have bought the confused emote. <laughs> wow. Bright Bomber was in the shop that day. <laughs> if only I had hindsight. Wow. I mean not really because I was already in the shop the other day. <laughs> so in the shop what was it? It's fucking what day was it? I mean if I think now it's it's Wednesday now, so Two days ago? Is that fuck? I don't know. Okay, and then on the 27th, I bought some more. Let's see what was in the shop on the 27th. That's five days later. This is weird. The football skins. I definitely don't have any of them. Um. None of these are modes. 26th of... No, sorry, 27th of June. Yeah, that's... Watch as I was fucking buying TR skips. <laughs> Imagine. I mean, it was early seasons. True. Yeah, let me do something different. Let me go the day ahead. Let's see what was there. Okay. Uh, they had Disco Fever the day ahead, so maybe I bought Disco Fever. Because I do have Disco Fever. Okay, 
let's let's go back a bit. supposed to be seen when the last purchase of a fucking loot box was. I think so, yeah. up to where me stop playing Overwatch was around when I started getting into Fortnite. Oh, yeah. Oh, boy. <laughs> yeah, let's see. Because I, I, just, I just saw it two seconds ago. Where was it? We was like it, Fortnite. Was it Overwatch? Was it Overwatch? Yeah, there it is. Two anniversary boxes on the 8th of the 6th, 2018. So I started playing on roughly 6th of the 7th, 2016. And roughly finished on the eight of the six, twenty eighteen. So I didn't even actually survive two years. Wow. I survived one year, eleven months, and two days. Oh, seven hundred. You make it sound like it was traumatic. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I do. Actually. I mean, I mean. S sorry, I mean. <laughs> what what I meant to say is I, I spent three hundred and nine pound on loot boxes in a year and eleven months. <laughs> oh god, this is gonna take Okay, when did four season? When did I first buy it? Okay, four Mario, please come to the castle. I would like to keep you here. You're a truly princess princess. Was earlier. End it in the future. Twenty <laughs> fifth of the seventh, twenty seventeen. And I've had a shit ton of purchases in between, so this is gonna be tough. Although I am going to scroll all the way to the bottom so I can do it in such a cool order. And then I can also find out when I first bought V-Bucks. Find out, I guess, what. Want to buy them. Okay. Ha.
fight. Wait. Ancient Trilogy was June 30th? Yeah, I got the launch. Wait, what? What even is the launch part? I mean, I'm guessing it means like launch day part? I got it in August, anyway. <laughs> like a month after. Sure. No, wait, no. Two months after. Well, it was at the start, so... Eh, who cares? Okay. Well, since I, 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 I now know the exact day I started playing Fortnite, the 4th of October 27. And the reason I know this is because it literally has that I purchased this. Well, quote unquote, purchased Fortnite on that day. Imagine purchasing Fortnite. <laughs> yeah, it just says it's zero pounds and zero pence. I think I first started. It was around this time three years ago. Okay. Yes, yeah, fun. We can do. Let's go see what was in the item shop on the day I bought the game. Well, quote unquote, bought the day I started playing. Oh, okay. I cannot see what was in the item shop that day. Okay. The website apparently doesn't go that far back. <laughs> See if anywhere has it like document. Um board I I tell October 31st, 27. 
Oh, wait. Got knocked over 26. Let's go see what was on my birthday in 2017 on the item shop. Oh, Skull Trooper and Gold Trooper. Oh, perfect! <laughs> perfect birthday present that I never bought myself. Was Fort Nightmares. Yeah. Oh, wait. Wait, no, 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 no. That can't be right. Was the item shop not at it until then? No, that can't be right. Because I'm seeing these patch notes from the 25th of the 10th, and in the patch notes is Battle Royale Item Shop and Lockout. We're exploring new and unique array of outfits, gliders, and backpacks in the item shop. No. Use V-Bucks to purchase cosmetics. Is that why? Did it actually not exist before then? Oh! Because before then, they had the season shop. Uh... I think that might be it. That might be it. One sec. It's all coming together. <laughs> That's it, no, 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 sorry, the season, the, the, the fucking season shop was also added then. Really? I started playing in season zero. Oh. Season one started October 25th. <gasps> that makes so much sense. <laughs> oh, fuck, so I actually did play season zero. Wow, okay. Wow. Jesus. There's a it just added leaderboards in that update as well. And the locker. Let's have a let's actually have a look at these patch notes. See what they actually <laughs> did, not just 
Okay, we start off with performance. Greatly reduced input latency on PlayStation 4 and Xbox One. Uh, controls overall should feel more responsive on consoles. We've re-enabled capped 30 FPS on PS4 and PS4 Pro to maintain a smooth experience. PS4 I can understand, but PS4 Pro capped at 30? I know, right? What? Um, gameplay, I did an option to tog toggle tog in. Okay. Okay, patch notes battle royale. Oh my god. The first one. Introducing slurp juice. A regeneration oh. version that grants a one health and one shield per second for 25 seconds. I missed the slurp juice. That was OG slurp juice. I don't miss that slurp juice though. Oh, that was OG slurp juice. That was different. You can now customize your character, banner, and equip any young cosmetics in new block up in. Uh, settings have been reset, this is a side of that, that, that was literally what they did with chapter 2 season. Mm -hmm. They accidentally reset everyone's fucking controls and settings. Uh, players will now auto pick up ammo built in sources and traps. Wait, didn't have auto pick up? Oh, Jesus. Let's see, they just had a spam button. Uh, new graphics are visible to players who are caught outside the storm safe zone and the storm wall visuals have New Halloween skins are on sale in the store and will only be available until the 4th of May. And then again, we'll put them back. Uh, use me books to purchase items from the store. Character skins, scope, trooper, weapon skins, reaper, skin, guns. The new combat, uh, combat pro controller config aimed at keeping users' thumbs on the sticks as much as possible so they can fast on weapon swaps and build quick. Uh, and then it gives more. So chapter three, can they reset our builds again and keybinds? That was a lot of fun to redo. Okay, I am sure players can now purchase you already, you've already said that, haven't you? Yeah. Uh, offers will rotate on both a week daily basis. All items sold are cosmetic only and do not grant any competitive advantage. Or, more like they do until we patch them out. <laughs> Just saying. Um, purchase items can be equipped in the locker screen prior to starting match. No purchases from Battle Royale store do not carry over to the Save the World mode. That is no longer true. Because you can use Battle Royale skin to save the world. True. Um, even though I don't play, even though I knew that. When I do play, it's literally just to get the food you read the books on the game. Because <laughs> who doesn't like some free V-Bucks? Uh, yeah, so let's go and talk about the locker room again. Lead up on, here we are. Rank up against other players and friends in the following categories. Total wins, solo, top 10, top 5, duo, top 5, top 12, squads, top 3, top 6. There are currently two types of leaderboards. Division leaderboards. A division is a group of 50 active players competing against each other to see who will take the top spot. You are automatically assigned to a new division each one. Each match type. So the dudes and squad gets its own separate division. And then friends leaderboard. Compare yourself to your friends by turning on friends. Division board. Is that literally just like regularly boards? I think did, so. Did that become, I'm guessing that might have become the regular boards. I, I guess back then they could only have 50 people at a time. I have what that is. Uh, all leaderboards reset. 
on Wednesdays. Only players on your platform are included, but of course back then there was no crossplay. I've been playing Fortnite. Well, okay, I haven't been playing this long, but I first played Fortnite one thousand two hundred days ago, or three years and four months. Wow. Wow, I haven't changed in about three years. I'm still the Avengers, although I just joke and say it's the IVA logo. <laughs> uh, the first season will give us a chance to level up to 100. Play out of the ball to slide on that banner. Really? I thought the first one was... Here we go! A hundred levels.
crazy. Oh, yeah. So yeah, that's that's it. And the ones you could buy were uh, Goliath, two different riders and pickaxe, uh, aerial assault trooper, and it. can boost their seasonal wealth by participating in daily challenges. Your challenge will be provided each day with the ability to have two three active challenges to Completing daily challenges will provide a player with seasonal XP and... I mean... Yeah, we still have challenges, just they work mm -hmm. differently. Yeah. Well, way differently now. Imagine if it was still that you could only have three active. Oh, that would be terrible. And then they added the season rocket launcher, which was pumpkin horn. Oh, the jackal. Oh, I'm gonna fuck you with follow wherever you live. Oh, I, sh I mean, depending on where. Storm effects, play squad and second storm, maybe in fright, effects of visual for a much more intense experience. Storm in air. Back, back row, we've already flat. Here we go! Let's just look. Uh, uh, oh, reduced supply drop balloon level. 2000 to 1250. Names which are spawned from treasure chests, armor box, or armor boxes, or now less likely to be clustered together. Just the chance of storm seeds and firing at the edges of the island. Yeah, reduced the chances. I mean, technically, uh, that still sometimes happens to this day. Situations, just saying. Although now it's not as bad because you don't fucking die. <laughs> like you did before. Um, just the chance. Yeah, 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 just run. Fix supply drops, not. How's the run? Dog shit. <laughs> oh, yeah, you're speedrunning, aren't you? <laughs> yes. <laughs> totally Bug which caused stacked items to not automatically add to the quick ball when done. Ooh, weapons, we want a weapons, yeah. Adjusted submachine gun. Uh, Here we go. Common slash uncommon damage increased from 11 to 12. Rare damage increased from 12 to 13. Decreased reload time by 15%. Um, sniper rifle, projectiles, now visual drill behind. Uh, assault rifle, reduced accuracy. Uh, and I know, because I'm probably not going to be around for long. So I'm really tired. Um, does not affect first or scoped variants. Scoped assault rifle, updated visuals went to day and trace. Uh, effects and smoke now match the weapon's behavior. Fixed an issue which caused the transition from the hip by position to target and to rotate the player now downwards. Fixed an issue which caused recoil weapons to not recoil. If hey, boom. we can. Yeah. 
Buckshrolls. Aim and set stick beyond Buckshrolls, now skilled with your weapon soon, similar to how it does with a mouse. This change replaces the previous sensitive features of the game to scope weapons. Change some default key windings for quick slots. Fourth quick slot has been changed from the Z key to 5, and the fifth quick slot has been changed from the X key to 6. Right. Why was it on those keys in the first place? I do not know. Uh, improved analog stick responses when we take the camera. It should be better. Just to your aim on controllers. Improved how interactions such as teammate revives, pickups, and opening doors are prioritized when there are multiple possible options. Smoothed out the camera transition, transition to Ryan the Battle Bus and get into Sky. I did more to the area with containers south of Tomato Town and shifted this to begin a line with build oh, sorry, to better align with the build. Oh, uh, fixed issues where grass could be hidden on in certain types of terrain. Various fixes for terrain. Seams and floating objects. Fix some objects that were previously indestructible. Audio voice chat now works while spectating teammates and after the matches. Uh, decrease the distance players can hear CL and ball trap audio. Added ambient zap audio to placed traps. Fixed issue which caused step audio to be drowned out while other sounds were playing. Fixed an issue which caused the footstep sounds to trigger multiple times per step. You are but it's several new ways to access the item shop blocker and other new features. I did a season shop tab. This is a preview of a feature still in development. I will implement it. An LR update. <clears throat> Bullshit. Uh, changed how the message did. Displayed the message now pops up. You can now match make the feed, but only if there is new information. I did since the last time you saw it. Improved the looks and feels of the stats in the face. Adjusted rarity, color, suitable items, and chances of finding life chests or if gold remains unchanged. Medicaid is now green, common, and shield version is now blue and red. I wonder what they used to be beforehand. Are they grey? Might be grey. Oh, I'm guessing. Chief, so that's interesting. Um, as I highlight background behind the currently active built in resource, the menu can now be opened while spectating. Tain. Resources can now be dropped on control. You couldn't drop resources using a control that previously. Okay. Moved show grass off from the options menu in Battle Royale. Uh, grass and village is always intended to be visible. You used to be able to remove the grass, oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, I wonder what it looked like when it turned off. Uh, fixed an issue which caused your weapon to continue firing after opening the full screen map. Fixed an issue which caused the final damage done to an enemy to not display hit effects. Fixed an issue which caused the right bolt to remove it out after reloading all the way of ammo. Performance issue, uh, performance fixes. These foliage will no longer cause very low frame rates when material quality is set to anything lower than high. Anything lower than high? Okay. Implemented profile guided optimization to help overall CPU performance on consoles. System performs, reduced hitching issues on both platforms, fixed the visual of 
lives on trees with the graphics combinations. Oh, known issues. What was it, the known issues back then? Select a party member in the lobby will display an incorrect banner. Okay. Other players gliders may appear lopsided if a glider cuts many points in a way. Okay. Slurp juice could be found and consumed in the pre stage area, which resulted in 25 shield carrying over into the actual match. <laughs> Yo, what? He's doing a dr drink a slurp juice on Spawn Island and actually get the effects of it in the match. Yo, that's like cheating, man. Can't do that. <laughs> Uh, save the world, we're not gonna be as weak as us. That's it, that, that is everything. Season 1, patch notes. Who's, now, re who's ready for what? the 37 star world record? Never been done before by anyone. Oh my god, the I'm looking at the comments on the tweet and it's actually like. struggled stuff. Don't be happy about that. I'm so nervous right now. <laughs> well, back in 27, this guy was like, how about some V-Box for winning pure games? <laughs> yeah, <no>. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that's crazy. Twenty twenty eighteen. Yes. And so, it's so still going. For you in chat that are missing this context. Um back on October twenty fifth, twenty seventeen, some random Twitter user predicted well, I say he didn't actually predict it because it didn't actually happen, but you know, he thought that Fortnite would die out or at least the Battle Royale portion of it would die out in 2018 and that saved the world to us to be free then. <laughs> Meanwhile, Fortnite's still alive and saved the world. We'll never be free. Yep. That is wild. I mean, there was the one oh of the biggest God. events, like. Okay, this guy predicted two months ago. something. Okay. Add fifty versus fifty. Oh. And we did get fifty versus fifty. And it was crazy. Yeah, he said. He said add fifty versus fifty. 
it'll be insane. At least I think that's what he was trying to say, but he actually said, add 50 versus 50, it'll insane. <laughs> Oh, I've got, yeah, oh, I'm going to have to end stream in a sec. Epic wants me to do something about my support creator, because of the whole support creator 2.0. Oh, really? Mm. I totally forgot about Thanks, Epic. Dickheads. <laughs> Wait, is it like So basically, Wait, so I've got. That they've, they've emailed me saying I've got to migrate to 2.0. Oh, what? You lose your code? Or I'll lose my code, yeah. Damn. And I just used your code today. Oh. In the item shop. In Fortnite Ball Royale. Wow, you that's good. Cool. Broodline. Hashtag Buy ad. Any skin. Or any cosmetic. And Hashtag. I think you can just use it in some other fucking games. I don't yeah, know. Yeah, you can use it when purchasing games as well. Probably. But who cares about the schemes? What we care about is Fortnite. Yeah. Right, I'm gonna end stream so I can deal with that shit. I'll see you all tomorrow. I'll probably do. I'll probably wake up early to do runs. See you soon. Take care. Goodbye. Good night. See ya. I'm gonna wait for Mario to say say the line and then <laughs> and Thank you so much for playing my game.